Hello everyone, myself Yesha Patel and I am going to explain the muscle adductor hallucis. Adductor hallucis arises by two heads, first is oblique and second is transverse and both the heads are responsible for adducting the big toe. Both the heads are inverted by the plantar lateral nerve. Now further, let's discuss about its origin. Adductor hallucis. It arises by two heads. The oblique head is large and arises from the basis of the second, third and fourth metatarsals, from the sheath of the tendon of the peroneus longus. And the transverse head is small and arises from the deep metatarsal ligament and the plantar ligaments of the metatarsophalangeal joints of the third, fourth and fifth toes. Now its insertion on the lateral side of the base of the proximal phalanx of the big toe in common with the lateral tendon of the flexor hallucis brevis. Nerve supply of adductor hallucis is deep branch of lateral plantar nerve which terminates in this muscle. Action of adductor hallucis is adductor of great toe towards the second toe which means the oblique head and the transverse head. The oblique head when moves towards the transverse head it is known as adductor of great toe towards the second toe. Action of adductor hallucis is it maintains transverse arches of foot which means the calcaneum is pushed slightly towards the phalanges. Thus the posterior transverse arch gets maintained because of its position and the anterior transverse arch maintains because of the origin of the muscle.